I am Dr. Ramakrishna Prasad. I am a board certified family medicine specialist and an HIV AIDS specialist. I practice at Health Roots Clinics in Sheshadripuram and Vijayanagar, Bangalore. I also serve as a faculty in family medicine, HIV AIDS and viral hepatitis at St. Philomena's Hospital in Bangalore. The question posed is, can HIV symptoms persist despite a negative fourth generation antigen antibody HIV test? It's very important to understand that the answer to this depends when the exposure happened and when the antigen antibody test was done. Let us examine this in three scenarios. First scenario, say supposing someone has unprotected sexual intercourse or an, an exposure, let us say a week back and say the HIV antigen antibody test is done today and it comes back negative. Within a week, this test is not able to determine whether infection has happened or not happened. As a result, if someone is having symptoms, one cannot say whether this is related to HIV or not. That is why uh, basically this person will need to be retested in a few weeks ideally four to six weeks. The second scenario, say someone who's been exposed to HIV six weeks back or eight weeks back or 12 weeks back. And in them, uh, say at the end of three months or 12 weeks, the HIV 1, 2 uh, antigen, that is the fourth generation uh, test is done and it is negative. In that person, uh, assuming no further exposures in the, in the interim, um, that result indicates a negative result that person is not infected with HIV. As a result, whatever symptoms that person is having are not related to HIV and possibly due to some other uh, reason. The third situation is when combination test or the fourth generation antigen antibody test is done at say three to four weeks. Typically, this is an interval where test is able to determine if infection has happened or not happened. But in some cases, if there is any doubt, then the test needs to be repeated at an interval between six and 12 weeks. So to summarize, the way to think about this is first of all, the HIV symptoms, the symptoms you are experiencing may be related to HIV or may not be related to HIV. If your exposure happened more than three months ago and the antigen antibody test is negative, uh, these symptoms cannot be explained by HIV infection, you do not have HIV infection. I hope that answers your question.